Um, I'm probably not going to do a straight review of, um, I think it's called Dirty Laundry. Uh, let's see. Oh, wow, there's a bunch of things called Dirty Laundry, apparently. Okay, here we go. Dirty Laundry, Punisher. It's great to see, um, it, you know, I'm a big fan of Adi Shankar and the, the bootleg universe. Um, you know, overall, I'd probably say I, I prefer the the one he did on the, um, yeah, you know, my favorite's the Power Ranger one. It's just so much fun. Uh, then you have the, an, another really great one is the one on Venom. Uh, I think it's called Truth in Journalism or something. The Punisher Dirty Laundry is also quite good. Um, yeah, I, I, I don't have much to say about it. I wish it wasn't a white guy going into a black neighborhood and saving the you know model minority from a bunch of you know really xenophobically racistly drawn minorities um you know the the uh the brutality of it is fairly on point for punisher uh not nicely done although it's had much uh, cgi um let's see i think that is pretty much it um, I can understand if some people, like, think it's lame that it plays coy with being Punisher until, I think it's only at the very end that, like, you see, oh, you know, he holds up the, the, the kid holds up the, the Punisher skull shirt, you know, uh, I don't mind it, I think it's fine, um, yeah, uh, uh, right now, like, like I said, my favorite is definitely, um, John... I can't believe I'm blanking on his name. Um, the, um, okay, I'll find it real quick. There we go. John Bernthal. Uh, but I do still really like uh, the, um, yeah, Thomas Jane. 